The electric car study, I just picked this because it's, it's interesting, fascinating how the world is talking about electric cars and are embracing that. Um, and hey, yeah, it's, it's kind of fun to be an electric car because it's so fast, you're rapid at 100 kilometers per hour just within you know, a couple of seconds. Um, but the impact on the physical body is really underestimated and not looked at. The highest exposure by far and large in any car is an electric car. And it does not matter whether it's a Tesla, an electric Porsche, uh, we, we tested the Teslas and electric cars. That is, by the way, right now in Europe, the strongest electric car available on the market, the Porsche. And that was uh, actually part of the study here. So people get lasting effects from that. Like we've, we've personally even spoken with people that have lasting migraines uh, from being an electric car. Um, and now we even get migraines that turn on if they even go into a regular car because the the body has been programmed that it's going to be impacted like that much that it's such an impact on the physical body that even if you get into a normal car, the, the body already reacts even though it's not even an electric car. So it really is something of concern that we should be aware of, but it's also not too much of a concern because thankfully there are ways to mitigate it. So. So um, the result was basically that in all the experiments that were done, um, regardless uh, of how strong the exposure was, our technology was able to harmonize all of the effects that were shown um, in all of the different organs. Uh, and that's actually quite fascinating. So they even, so the longer you drive an electric car, the higher your EMF exposure. And you can actually measure that with a regular meter. Right? You just have an EMF meter and you can test that and then you uh, drive it for like an hour and then the exposure is higher. Now, if you then have a passenger that is uh, surfing on the web while you're driving and you are on the phone, then you start to uh, have all these different signals amplifying each other um, to a new level. And so you can see that then in the different organs and how you can measure cellular voltage and, and the health and you know some people really react already with, with migraines or headaches uh, at that point. So all of that was neutralized.